Hey guys, today it is December the 3rd. My name is Jess McDonnell and you're watching GameSpot News. Bethesda has confirmed that another Doom Alpha will be taking place beginning tonight. The Alpha begins at 7pm PT tonight and will run up until Sunday, December 6 at 8.59pm PT. Much like the previous Alpha, this is only open to a select group who pre-ordered Wolfenstein The New Order and signed up for access. You can check to see if you're eligible by looking for the Alpha in your PS4 or Steam library, while Xbox One owners should check their Xbox Live messages. If you purchased a physical copy, you can check out the process for getting into the Alpha on GameSpot. At this stage, the Alpha only contains a single map, one game mode, and seven weapons. EA has admitted that Star Wars Battlefront was designed to be accessible and as a result may not have had the depth that hardcore players were after. At the recent Nasdaq Investor Conference in Europe, EA CFO Blake Jorgensen explained, Star Wars Battlefront is a first-person shooter, but it is one of the only team-rated first-person shooters. We had designed it to be a much more accessible product to a wider age group. For the hardcore, it may not have had the depth that they wanted in the game. Elsewhere during the presentation, Jorgensen said, he expects Battlefront to be a huge hit this year, particularly when it can capitalize on the release of Star Wars The Force Awakens. He said he's confident that the game will ship its target of 13 million copies. Finally, after telling us they were not going to talk about the NX console this year, Nintendo did have something to say about it in a recent time interview. New Nintendo president Tatsumi Kimishima explained, I can assure you we're not building the next version of Wii or Wii U. It's something quite unique and different. It's something where we have to move away from those platforms in order to make it something that will appeal to our consumer base. He added that it's difficult to convince consumers to switch from their current platform to the next platform. And that, as far as he knows, there is no meaning behind the codename NX. Although he did add, perhaps Mr. Iwata had meant to tell me and then never got the chance. Let me know down in the comments how interested you are in Nintendo's NX. You can head to GameSpot where we've got stories on Uncharted 4's multiplayer beta and a Fallout 4 beta PC patch. That is everything I've got for you today, but do join me same time tomorrow for the biggest stories of the entire week. I will catch you then.